Catch her. Conan O'Brien's fiery encounter at the 2024 Newport Folk Festival. The Newport Folk Festival is known for its rich tapestry of music, culture, and unforgettable moments. Yet, in 2024, it became the backdrop for a drama that captivated audiences far beyond the park's borders. Imagine the scene, the sun is shining, the air is filled with the sweet sounds of folk music, and suddenly, a confrontation unfolds that no one saw coming. Enter Conan O'Brien, the beloved late-night host known for his quick wit and humorous take on life, and Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, who sparked a whirlwind of controversy. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. As the festival kicked off, excitement buzzed through Fort Adams State Park. Fans flocked to see their favorite artists, from indie darlings to veteran folk legends. The spirit of collaboration and creativity was palpable, with surprise performances and impromptu jam sessions lighting up the stage. However, the joy of the festival would soon be overshadowed by an unexpected incident that would leave attendees and viewers buzzing. On that fateful day, Conan O'Brien strolled through the festival grounds, mingling with fans and soaking in the vibrant atmosphere. As a comedic icon, he was in his element, exchanging jokes and laughter with festival goers. Yet, amidst the merriment, Meghan Markle was also in attendance, creating a stir of her own. Known for her philanthropic efforts and advocacy, she had come to experience the festival and engage with fans, but things quickly took a turn. Witnesses reported that Markle was involved in a series of antics that many deemed disgusting. From playful pranks to an unexpected interaction with a local band, her behavior began to raise eyebrows. While some found it entertaining, others were less amused. As the festival goers watched, whispers spread like wildfire. What was happening? Was this a calculated move or just a spontaneous burst of fun that went awry? As the atmosphere shifted, Conan's laughter began to fade. The comedian, who has always prided himself on his ability to find humor in any situation, couldn't quite see the funny side of this one. Reports indicate that he witnessed Markle engaging in what he described as disrespectful behavior towards some of the festival's artists. His frustration boiled over when he saw her seemingly dismissive attitude towards a group of aspiring musicians who were performing nearby. In a moment of unexpected intensity, Conan whipped out his phone and, in a fit of anger, called the cops. Catch her, he exclaimed, referring to Markle and her antics. The sheer absurdity of the situation shocked onlookers. Here was a beloved comedian, known for his lightheartedness, demanding law enforcement's involvement at a music festival. It was a scene that felt ripped from a satirical comedy sketch, yet it was all too real. As word spread about Conan's call to the police, social media erupted. Memes, tweets, and TikToks flooded platforms, with users capturing the bizarre essence of the moment. Some sided with Conan, expressing concern over Markle's behavior. Others criticized his reaction, arguing that calling the cops was an overreaction in a place meant for creativity and celebration. The media quickly picked up the story, framing it as a clash between two cultural icons. Headlines blared, Conan O'Brien calls cops on Meghan Markle, and Newport Folk Festival turns into a reality show. The ensuing discourse was a mixture of outrage, humor, and disbelief. Fans of both celebrities weighed in, creating a lively debate that showcased the ever-evolving relationship between public figures and their actions. As the situation escalated, it became evident that this was not just a simple misunderstanding. The festival organizers had to step in to diffuse the tension. They issued statements urging attendees to focus on the music and community spirit that the festival embodies. Let's not lose sight of what brings us together, they implored, trying to steer the conversation back to the heart of the event. Meanwhile, Conan, ever the entertainer, took to the stage later that day. With his trademark humor, he addressed the incident head-on. You know, folks, I always thought I'd be the one getting arrested at a music festival, not calling the cops on a royal, he quipped, drawing laughter from the crowd. It was a masterclass in turning an awkward situation into comedy gold. In the days following the event, Meghan Markle found herself at the center of a media frenzy. She released a statement addressing the incident, 
expressing her surprise at the reaction and emphasizing her intentions to enjoy the festival and support local artists. Music brings people together, and that's what I came to celebrate, she stated. Her fans rallied behind her, defending her actions and painting her as a victim of sensationalism. The conflicting narratives began to intertwine, with each side claiming their truth. It became a classic tale of celebrity culture, the clash of personas, the misunderstanding, and, ultimately, the Redemption Art Festival attendees who witnessed the event found themselves sharing their own interpretations, adding layers to the story that would echo long after the final notes faded. This incident sparked a broader conversation about celebrity behavior and public perception. In an age of social media, where every action is scrutinized, the line between entertainment and reality blurs. Conan and Meghan, both influential figures in their own right, found themselves at the crossroads of comedy and controversy. Was Conan justified in his reaction, or was it a case of taking things too far? Should Meghan's antics be viewed as playful or disrespectful? These questions lingered, encouraging fans to reflect on their own views of fame, accountability, and the human experience. As the dust settled on the Newport Folk Festival, one thing was clear, the event was anything but ordinary. From hilarious moments to heated debates, it encapsulated the spirit of art and expression. Conan O'Brien and Meghan Markle, despite their differences, reminded us that even in chaos, there's room for laughter and dialogue. In the end, the Newport Folk Festival proved that music, like life, is filled with unexpected twists and turns. And while we may never know the full story behind that day, we can take away a valuable lesson, embrace the unpredictability, find joy in the absurd, and always be ready for the next surprise. So, the next time you find yourself at a festival, keep your eyes peeled, who knows what might happen next.